There were over 6 million Jews dead in the Holocaust. Adolf Eichmann was responsible for most of them. Adolf Eichmann was the main lieutenant for the Nazis. After World War II, he tried to escape unpunished for all of the Jews killed. But a group like the CSI for Israel called the Mossad was tasked in finding him and making him pay for his crimes. The book The Nazi Hunters by Neil Bascom. He tells the story of the Mossad and their journey on capturing one of World War II's biggest killers. The Mossad went through very tough struggles to create a scheme to capture him and bring him to trial. Some situations Mossad went through was trying to find Eichmann in the first place. How could they secretly capture Eichmann? They had many genius plans, like making a fake suitcase where a camera was inside so they could take photographs of who they thought was Eichmann. And the person who they thought was Eichmann was photographed unnoticed. There was also many social issues in the book. The first social issue is the Holocaust and the discrimination of Jews. In the opening pages of the book, it followed what a Jew lived like in a place like Auschwitz. They had to fight, work hard, and do anything they could just to get a small portion of food. The author claimed in the start of the book that the Jews weren't treated like humans or even animals, but a disease the Nazis wanted to get rid of them. Another social issue in the book is Nazis fleeing the country, trying to get unpunished for their crimes. One of the worst people in the Nazi party, Joseph Mengele, nicknamed the Angel of Death, was a doctor in the concentration camps and would perform deadly experiments on the Jews. He successfully stayed in South America under a new identity, and nobody could find a trace of him. Adolf Eichmann did not get that kind of luck. The Nazis needed to be punished for their crimes. Eichmann was one of the highest ranks in the Nazis. After World War II, U.S. troops successfully captured Eichmann, but he managed to escape and he relied on a new identity. He did rely on that new identity for a while until the Mossad agents in Israel captured him and put him to trial. In trial, Eichmann was found guilty and was hung. Eichmann tried to create a new identity for all the deaths that he was responsible for. This brings us to the theme statement. The theme statement or the author's purpose from this book is you can't run away from your past.